Hi guys, welcome back once again to another episode of the Alubonaga show. Today we shifted from our studio to somewhere else. We are here at the fitness house at uh, Dargopathar opposite ARTC. And today we are using the space for this show. Ladies and gentlemen, today I'm very excited to announce the two personalities who are here in in the show today. The first one is uh, Moa Long Yadan. For those who don't know, he is an athlete, a bodybuilder. Uh, recently, he got the fifth position at the WBPF Sports Physic uh, at Uzbekistan. And then uh, also, uh, he was at the top 10 at the IBBF Federation Cup under 70 kilo. And uh, Jerai Men's Physic, second runners up. And uh, the next guest is uh, Along, uh, also known as Longsa Tiger, another an MMA player from Nagaland. Uh, he was the gold medalist at the uh, AIMMAF. Emma. Then uh, he was the finalist at Gamma at uh, 2019, and recently he went to Kazakhstan and he brought silver medal at the uh, Gamma Asian Championship. So, without further ado, I would like to welcome Mualong and Along. Hi guys, welcome. Yeah, hello. First of all, thank you so much for coming, you know. And how do you feel Kiniga Lagiesa to be in the show? <laughs> uh, first of all, uh, thank you so much for having us in this show. Uh, we are a regular viewer of yours. Uh, we do really enjoy uh, you, you know, inviting the Arnaga, uh, uh, you know, uh, people who are from different backgrounds and then, you know, giving them an exposure platform to you know, tell the stories. So uh, it's my time to tell my story to you guys mm -hmm. as well. And I hope uh, you guys enjoy. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, welcome, welcome. For having us. And like, at the same time, I'm so very nervous. It's, uh, I feel like fighting is more easier. <laughs> <to Okay. perform>. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I feel you, I feel you. Just relax, OK? okay. Uh, you can, we can use Nagamese, English, Hindi, anything mm. you're comfortable with. We will go ahead with that. But before we go, uh, any further, we want to congratulate you. For those who Thank don't so know, Molong just got married, and yeah, yeah congratulations Thank on the so first in, uh, second innings of your <laughs> life, and yeah, we wish you the best. Thank you. So let's go back uh, to uh, let's go to our conversation here. Uh, so please tell us about yourself, Abnihan La Kiniga, Aisha lifestyle, your profession, our background, Kiniga. Say maybe we can start with Along. Yeah. Okay. Uh, hello everyone. My name is Long Tsugumbao. I'm an MMA athlete. Uh, I train at the uh, Combat Academy Timapur Naglen under the head coach Kermele Meta. And yeah, uh, I belong from a uh, uh, simple and middle class family. Yeah, that's it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, hi everyone, my name is Molong Yadin. Uh, I am a mix of Ao and Sema. Mm -hmm. uh, I studied from Patkai uh, as well as I did my graduation from uh, Sikkim. Uh, did my uh, professional uh, bo bodybuilding. Uh, from 2016, and Ooh. it's been uh, it's been a very good journey for me so far. Wow! Thank you so much for introducing us. Uh, Mualong, you are one of the most you know popular, demanding Naga, <laughs> you know, uh, male bodybuilder, fitness model, you know. So, what got you started in this industry? By the way, I saw your picture. You're so skinny then, right? Yeah. So, what made you start you know this journey? Uh, well, when I was in uh, Patkai, um, I was into a lot of. Um, alcohol and all, all stuff, you know, that mm -hmm. a teenagers go through. So uh, I was into dr uh, drugs as well. So oh. when I was in Patkai, I lost one of my friends because of uh, drug overdose. Mm -hmm. So which was a turning point in my life, mm -hmm. uh, after which I had to go to Sikkim. And then out there in Sikkim, um, after I left my addiction with the drugs and all, I went to Sikkim and then uh, I got addicted to alcohol. Mm -hmm. Now Sikkim is a place where alcohol is very cheap. So um, on my BFS here, I fell sick. I had a, um, a liver uh, infection because of uh, alcohol. Mm -hmm. So after which the doctor told me that if I continue the lifestyle that I have now, then I won't live long. So wow. which was uh, which was a scary moment for me, mm -hmm. and it was really embarrassing for me to you know even call my parents and then tell them uh, what I have done and. So that was a turning point, and then that's how I left all my, you know, uh, uh, past life, and then mm -hmm. I continued the fitness. Mm -hmm. Initially, it was not easy. I mean, me being an alcoholic and try to trying myself to detox stuff from my body was not easy. Uh, mm -hmm. I was 51 kilo when I started, and 
once I started, uh, I, I never turned back and it was just pushing myself, pushing myself. And in the year 2016, I competed professionally mm -hmm. uh, under the uh, coach, under coach Pritam Singh Morangtem. Mm -hmm. uh, Pritam Singh, mm -hmm. uh, he is from a uh, CRPF team. Wow. Uh, after which uh, I, uh, I was competing for Jirai, where I got second runners up, and then I competed for uh, Mr. India again. Uh, twice representing wow. Manipur uh, wow. because uh, Nagaland didn't have any association oh, really? and to compete wow. to Mr. India you need to have an association so but then in the year 2018 Nagaland got registered with the uh, Indian Bodybuilding Federation which is under Ministry of Sports and Youth Affairs yeah. so after which uh, I, I competed for Federation Cup mm -hmm. where I was under uh, Robbie Moirangtem mm -hmm. he is uh, the a world champion as well as a Mr. Asia and amateur Olympia champion. Uh, he competes. He competes for a uh, Navy team. Mm. So he is my current coach, and uh, with his blessing, I've been. You know, there, every competition I go, I get something. Wow, so really? hopefully in the future, I will get s some more. You know, medal for my mm -hmm. for sure, my I'm state sure. and for my country. Wow! Thank you so much for your, sharing your journey. I mean, <laughs> you've come a long way. Yeah. But it's very interesting to know that. Uh, Bodybuilding helped you to be a better person, yeah, you know, exactly. come out of the addiction also. So, yeah, thank you so much for sharing. Now, coming to along, so how did you start MMA? Because MMA, though, yeah. it's very new, right? And then, I want to start I mean, how often do you train and how did it all start? Uh, if I'm not wrong, uh, it was in the year uh, 2014 gotcha. when, like, one of my very close friends, mm -hmm. he's right. Behind here, sitting behind the okay, camera. Okay, okay. Like uh, he came to know about the combat academy, achha, achha. and he came to me and like mm -hmm. one day he came to me and like time we could say like, hey along, uh, MMA gym the uh, Mapuri way do you do you know that? I was just like, I don't know that. I was like, oh China so well like MMA gym to like, man ball infrastructure, man ball there, man one wrestling great there, kumba jaga there, ita ginare boxing big great there. Then why don't you join now? I got interested, and then the okay. next day I went up with him to check out the gym. Then mm -hmm. I like the gym though. Okay, then okay. I came, came back home. Then the next day again, I like approached my mom. Hoti wala kena hamay na sab to family family pa support kule ho. So I, I approached my mom. So thank you, uh, mom. Uh, I want to take uh, MMA kuche. So like amar kuche. Sure, why not kuche? Wow. So I <laughs> wait, wait. So I said, I'm going to go to the house. So like, MMA course is going to go to the house. So like, MMA is going to go to the house. I want to take like mixed martial arts. So like, to the point, mixed martial arts is going to go to the house. I picked no. No. So like, I mean, I'll say like, of course. But after two, three months, I was able to like, convince her. Then I started training. But like I always say, when I first started, it was never about like, competing or coming this far. It was like, we need fit whole and then mm -hmm. like to have some fighting skill. That's it. But uh, after like training for months and years, like I fell in love with the sport mm -hmm. and started competing. And yes, mm -hmm. here I am now. Wow! Congratulations! And then uh, kudos you. to your parents also, because here my lama and the one flight ti jabi boi lagar yada jai me me kilo that we Acha kwaada. I mean, kudos to your parents also. Now coming to uh, more long, uh, I. So how does it feel to be doing what you're doing, first of all, and then how long do you spend time in gym? Like, are you guys like always in the gym? Like, you know, how's your lifestyle? Uh, like, you first know? of all, it's not easy. Uh, you know, uh, uh, bodybuilding or fitness is very new to in our, in our state. True, true, true. And when I was in Delhi doing my uh, mm -hmm. certification for personal trainer, mm -hmm. uh, it, I did my personal trainer uh, certification from GFFI Academy uh, mm -hmm. Delhi. Achoo. So when I was doing my course, uh, my own friend and my own uh, cousins, they would make fun of me saying, you know, body building, body building, na ki kama wana, body building ki kuro, do pula pula hawa i luina birawle, you know, bura hawa she do so it'll dangle na the skin, you know. But then, uh, you know, there are times where I feel bad, mm -hmm. you know, my own friends, my own cousins, and all making fun of me. But then, um, my parents were always uh, positive, and then they always, you know. They were always there for me. So, kita manurwa na kuilibi. I think of my mom and dad, and then I say like, 
if they are happy with what I'm doing, then mm -hmm. why why do I care about others? And I care for court And then uh, a lot of people ask me this, like how how long do you spend? Right? Mm -hmm. So uh, Bodycraft Gym is uh, is my own gym. Okay. I'm the co-partner, okay. co-owner. So I spend any 24 hours there. I spend around half of the day at my gym wow. so six o'clock i'm there i and we close by 10 so mm -hmm. i'm there and then we open from 3 30 so i am there from 3 30 till 9 p.m and every day i work around three hours every day daily workout wow. which is like if i'm not competing mm -hmm. and if i'm getting ready for a competition mm -hmm. so which takes around three to four months so i work out like three hours in the morning and three hours in the evening so wow, dedication is like <laughs> beyond, you know, um, word. Uh, what about you? Kenya uh, training can happen. Kenya, I mean, Kenya could happen. No, like especially our tournament can happen. Yeah, yeah. And how long do you spend time in your training there? Academy? Like. Uh, we have like uh, one to two months again. Basically, mala training camp to. So like uh, five camp. That so we do like. Uh, Four to five hours a day, morning session like that, and evening session, you know, like normally, you know. But my first day, Kohli Parose. I'm also a trainer at our gym, so my man give me shake. So mostly, my be gym there by six in the morning, gym there, like and then eight, nine thirty, they go like that. Wow, wow, wow. Acha, so any Janu man, jada, apni manu lo to fight khilu le, isna. So apni opponent give me study kure, apni na kine aza. Or na kun baato na jani kine aya hai na. So how do you feel? Boi lagi na na lagi ni ni. Like. My coach always says, Achha. if you are scared of getting hit or like punch, you are in the wrong job. Achha. So like, it will not be able Of course, yeah, you should be scared of losing, but mark will not be able So, if you want to see your mind, you will be able to see your mind. That's it. Nagamandase. Dang. I love the word Nagamandase. So, some people want to know, how long does Mualong uh, spend in front of a mirror? Uh, gym is like a place where you, you know, uh -huh, all uh -huh. the four corners are in there. Okay. So every corner, every time I turn myself, my head, mm -hmm. there's a mirror. So wow, there are about nine, ten hours <laughs> in front of the mirror. <laughs> Damn, uh, interesting. <laughs> okay, now uh, what is the scope? Uh, let's start with MMA. Nagaland the scope na. Aro, abni lai sabte yedo bi yedo career banana wale, yedo support aro opportunity paile do, yedo pura career banana wale parvona na parvona do MMA like MMA na, true MMA. Naga manu kani like or. Ini ini, I mean especially mon naga manu inya. Okay, ah, like you said in the beginning, MMA do pisi nuthun sport zhe. But we should not forget that MMA is also one of the fastest growing sport in the world. True. So ah, we, true like MMA is like ah, naga manu ando like ektas na. We never give up easily. Mm -hmm. So in this combat sport, we need that mentality and personality that wow. we should not uh, give up easily. So mm -hmm. Nagam Manu, we have that mindset that we don't give up. Mm -hmm. So see, uh, when we fight, uh, two people get in, inside the cage and try actually thinking Marvel is this crazy. So like uh, Nagam Manu is warrior minded as right? Mm -hmm. So I mean, that is the scope to us in another journey as well. So like back okay, tonight. Okay. Wow. So yeah. We are gifted as well. And wow, that's good. By the way, before I move to next question, I brought my mom. Can I hear the session? I have been fighting. Ah, my baba is. Baba is. My dad. Yeah. Okay. Moving ahead with the same question. Do you think you know bodybuilding, brother, this tank fitness and all, we can make career? It's a nagalende. Given like proper support, opportunity, pay she will do. Yeah, I mean bodybuilding and fitness. You have. I mean, there's a there's a lot of opportunities. If you see. Except for like living apart in Nagaland, mm -hmm. if you go outside in any big city, you will you will find like good amount of trainers in all the like major cities. Mm -hmm. If you go international mm -hmm. as well, Ajila Dunya they say if you are sick, like most of the uh, even in the, in hospital mm -hmm. when you are sick or when you have uh, accident or any any physical mm -hmm. disability or uh, you know injuries, doctor recommend gym. One like you to uh, even the doctors, they, I, it, it's not a, it's not a, you know, mm -hmm. attack on the doctor. But then, one like the doctor on the gym na jabe na bhi koi the. Physiotherapist jabe. Physiotherapist our gym to the same niche na This is a unique physical exercise. So there was this client of mine where he had a uh, knee surgery. So he couldn't bend his knee. So he joined the gym and slowly, slowly I helped him. And then after which he was running and tai do. 
UPSC na SSC short service commission na ijula job the police la de rina jodo he got physically physical the so pass ho je she so even if you see in movies there are trainers mm-hmm. you see in sports there are trainers mm-hmm. any physical <clears throat> any you you check any everywhere you go in big uh, five star hotel there is gyms yeah. and for outside people fitness ko to man important as mm-hmm. but for us fitness ko to it's like or oh, fitness ko to or oh, bodybuilding mm-hmm. fitness and bodybuilding is very different acha acha okay so when you talk fitness fitness it may like you don't want to build a body fine mm-hmm. you can do at least fitness ko to you go to a gym you lift mm-hmm. and then you stay fit yeah. bodybuilding is a career bodybuilding okay. is like any other job where you spend 6 to 9 hours daily mm-hmm. and then you go and then you represent and then you mm-hmm. earn money through that you know no? so there's there's different and then kwanisha fitness is it's a it's a very uh, it's one of the most um, promising career okay. i should say where people fitness. respect you a lot acha oh, acha when it comes to say fitness because when you doctor be khoda khoda to you go to a doctor you respect a doctor because he has you know he makes you fit he makes you cure mm-hmm. uh, you know yeah, whatever yeah. sickness you have just like that fitness trainer can be people respect a lot mm-hmm. i don't know about here i mean yeah, but when i when i go in outside naglen mm-hmm. if i have a good physique and if i go out people come and they respect you a lot and they talk because to make that kind of body it yeah. takes a lot of dedication, dedication. and hard, yes, work, hard so. work yeah 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 true 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 i mean heads off to you guys for that acha so how is your diet ki khai apne gan usually like you know i'm sure you eat healthy or eat like na sab khai na ki nahi khai for me uh, hmm. 6 months 12 months the 6 months to it's like off season acha where i um, i recover from my you know from my competition so when we are in a competition we cut down the carbs acha so there's no rice there's no roti there's no bread uh sometimes we take sweet potato Achoo. the rest is like 1 uh, kilo of chicken or beef or fish every day Oops. and then um apple and then so many fruits dry fruits it's a very expensive sport yeah. so i should say wow. but then there's a lot of protein in that and a lot of supplementation mm-hmm. as well so when you take so much of uh, protein in your body um, uh, your there's a stress on your liver as well to in order as well as when your when your body is get on the stage two days or one day ahead, you cut down the sodium you cut down the water water also yeah so this competition for mr uh, mr world do it in with pani khane do it in so whenever wow. i'm thirsty i i take musk melon No, so it was it was it, it's it's a it, it's not easy getting getting on a stage mm-hmm. that having that peeled body right mm-hmm. so shredded body so competition jam the yes there's so much of stress in our body mm-hmm. mentally physically so after the competition six months again i recover so mm-hmm. i eat all everything i mean i enjoy it's like christmas for me <laughs> six months <laughs> i eat eat yeah, i eat everything man with the dedication yeah. what about you up new weekend diet kan yeah. like uh, normal days it ani khai absolutely na but the uh, mon fight i will them they like preparation lam de the diet to control grill like chicken eggs mm-hmm. na it on the che normal and like what what and the khai de de jinbe and the like six eggs mon fight came them de acha chicken 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 breast especially 2 to 250 grams acha acha what about you kiman khai de khai de and ah one tray de ni khai de ek din de ek din de ek tray so it's like morning breakfast evening uh, like morning uh, breakfast lunch dinner isn't it mm. so you have 30 10 10 eggs 10 eggs then 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 Okay, moving ahead. Uh, so recently, you went for this competition, yeah. right? And then uh, we saw uh, crowdfunding. You yeah. know, crowdfunding. Kuri thoda dikhe se apni jawo karne. I think my friend Yamfo was yeah. the one taking initiative and all. So, uh, how did you manage? I mean, did it help the crowdfunding? Na kine okuri na idu krusha. And then, uh, by the way, did the government also help you when you go for that uh, competition? Well, uh, the competition. Uh, for the Mr. World Uzbekistan de Jadule uh, it was sponsored by the people of Nagaland mm-hmm. crowdfunding kurina hi jo parchamai wow uh, 
to represent Nagal, uh, India and uh, as a new athlete. Mm -hmm. It was my first time. Okay. So we have to do a security deposit, which okay. will be refunded again. Mm -hmm. But then we have to do a security deposit of 1.50 lakhs. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, apart from that, there's my uh, individual expenses where I eat. Like mm -hmm. I said, one kilo chicken, 30 mm -hmm. eggs in yeah. a day and wow. apple and also. In a uh, first of all, I approached the government. Okay. But uh, during during the entire process of me going and visiting the government, uh, party merged with okay, So okay. there were so many important meetings happening, so I couldn't meet anyone. So I told uh, Brother King, mm -hmm. uh, he is the owner of uh, City Gym. City Gym. He called me and then we talked and then he said, can, we, can I suggest you something? Said, what? Said, let's do crowdfunding. Mm -hmm. so if you think it's right, then let's go. Even Yang Fo approached like, okay, we'll post it on Facebook. You know, Kurishe to Inawado. Like people were helping me. To mm -hmm. in the middle of uh, that uh, post, there was a there was a slight misunderstanding between the uh, uh, youth department and me. Achha. They didn't like the way I wrote. Where I said I went and I couldn't meet them. Mm -hmm. They were busy. To Inawado tan kushipane. They said like you should have left an appointment. Uh, you know, appointment talile bala solution. But then, I had a very limited time. Mm -hmm. uh, I went on a Thursday morning, and my uh, my security mm -hmm. deposit last date was on Saturday. Mm -hmm. Oh no, oh, it was on Monday morning. So you know, the Thursday, uh, Wednesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Wednesday, mm -hmm. Wednesday, they don't entertain anyone. Mm -hmm. So no, no appointments. So you know, Thursday they uh, were Thursday they they were busy. I couldn't meet them. I had a very limited time, so I had to come back and prepare myself for the competition mm -hmm. as well. So I thought, like, just forget it. I'll just manage on my own. I'll I'll see what I can do. And then I had to. And then we it was story to I I told Yang Fu and then I wrote mm -hmm. it. They didn't like how I wrote it down. Mm -hmm. uh, but then they did help me with the mm -hmm. uh, uh, amount of twenty five thousand. Mm -hmm. uh, which I'm thankful again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> From I the mean, government. Uh, so I'm I'm just thankful and uh it's we in in most of my interviews also, I, I it's not a blame game. They did their part, mm -hmm. I understand. I did my part. And I went out, I won something for my country, for my mm -hmm. state. And that's my duty. I did my duty and then that's it. Okay, but yeah, th thanks to the public first of all, especially yeah. you know, from Facebook, people were coming in and Doing this, I mean, coming forward to help and all. Yeah. Uh, yes, as the, everyone was, we, we were reading the comments and also it's the job of the department, mm -hmm. concert department. I don't know whether they have a scheme for this or not because all the sports does not come under, you know, the government schemes also. But then I wish even our leaders could have done individual capacity also, you know, because uh, if someone help you individual capacity also, you know, he also get the laurel, he also get the credit. And then it's not about the credit also, you know. If they are capable, they should come forward. But unfortunately, we don't see that much. And also, let me come back again. It's not that you didn't go. You went there and then you did not get the appointment. So I don't think they should also <laughs> feel yeah, bad I mean, also. When, well, when I received them on, they also told me that uh, bodybuilding to Olympic laga Category mm -hmm. it, which is the yes. A category. Bodybuilding mm -hmm. falls under B category. Yes, yes. So in order, they focus more on Olympic athletes in our So which is like, so for the athlete, for the sportsmen who are not under the Olympic Association, mm -hmm. what do we do? Mm -hmm. So I mean, it's just like a stepmotherly treatment to us, right? Mm -hmm. Whereas uh, Naga wrestling, it mm -hmm. doesn't come under Olympic criteria. Mein. Yeah. I don't know which category. Uh, under is it under A, B, or C category? I don't know. Mm -hmm. But then they get police stay mm -hmm. job by though. Mm -hmm. When you are a winner, I'm sure you, you yes, know. Yes, so yes, people yes, are yes, like yeah. sub inspector, we pay us. So tan tak te ina pay chulu. Why not help us as well? The nagal tan dole nagal nde khile do na. Whereas we represent India. True, true. So true. that was a when they wrote that, I was like, oh my goodness. To man dole. No matter how much we represent India, no matter how much medal we bring, gold, we still ruby for our state. There's no chance. I mean, there's no score for us. Mm -hmm. So, which was, which was very, it was really sad for me. You know, mm -hmm. thinking about all this, but then my mom and then my fam, my family, my mm -hmm. friends, the well wishers were there. So, I'm doing this for them, not for the, mm -hmm. not for yeah. the government. So.
Yes, no matter what, the show must go on. Yeah, so exactly. we, we can't, you know, just... Uh, well, I always say this, okay, like, uh, we should not depend. We should not depend, even to all the musicians also, any athletes also. Because uh, what, from my experience, if I depend, it delays my process. Exactly. So, keep pare kuri na jabi. Help kuri le to kile na lo na. Help kuri shi to hallelujah lo bi holy. If you depend on that, then mohan career do because mohan na to age thagi to ekta limit na. Exactly. Ekta age idu to na kili le idu to na parle music hobby sports hobby. To idu ra mo idu kui thagi. I mean, if we get why not? And then it's the job of our leaders, government also to help the upcoming you know athletes hobby, sports person hobby, dancer, any 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 you know. Uh, but then we should not wait. That's what I say. Now coming back to the same thing, up uh, you also went for the gamma thing yeah, and all, yeah. na. So, uh, at least twenty-five thousand budget. Uh, to, be, to be honest, like uh, we didn't uh, approach the government this time. Uh, since like uh, the community and individuals, na, mano bisi mangay ni financial di ulibi, nili financial charge ni ulibi, aro alak ti ulibi. So like, man, so like vaccinated whole lagi. So like, CM office like. Chief medical officer, that they were doing vaccine the time tick there. No problem for like uh, passport and all. To verification, police lah like wow. the police le tell it down by help question mm -hmm. So like uh, this time the one uh, government give me approach to question okay. because okay. man who is it? Oh, you have enough. Oh, so nice. So police are do do. I mean, the community, community bro, friends bro, can bro. Yeah, uh, like pussy manu kan. Oh, and then like uh, individuals ni. Our community, oh, well, since so I belong from our oh, community. Church, so. church, church. I thought like MMA community. No, no, no. Oh, church, from, from your yeah, community. community. Well, that's so encouraging. Yeah, you know? yeah I, it should be like that, I think, you know. Uh, we should come forward. You know, let's not wait for one another and keep our energy capacity, yeah. you know. And thank you so much for bringing Laurel, both of you, you know, like Jaishe, and then you're not representing Nagaland, you're representing India, you know, yeah. the bigger picture. So, yeah. Congratulations, and then uh, along with that, will you do MMA? Do you have any money to do MMA? Can do like suppose in your daily life, usually. So like, uh, sustain can you manage? For like, uh, uh, right now there is no money involved in the fight. Achha. But like I uh, mentioned earlier, like mm -hmm. I used to train people also, so from there only I get achha, achha. money achha, achha. from the gym. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, okay, okay. So, uh. Do you think, like, you talk about the fitness earlier, but bodybuilding, can we make career there also? Yeah, I mean, my my coaches, mm -hmm. they represent uh, CRPF, sure, some sure. represent Navy, some represent Railway. Mm -hmm. So when you are when you are a bodybuilder and when you have the potential, mm -hmm. the the services, they, they, you know, they take you in your team. Mm -hmm. So if I'm really good in my, my, my field, like bodybuilding, when I compete and when I get gold or silver, they'll they'll just call me and I come join my t uh, you know service and then Robbie uh, Robbie Moirang team like okay. I said my coach sure. he is under Navy team. Okay. So, to the police can be like Manipur does like police police meet can bodybuilding competition or police team police can be like. Okay. So I hope that Nagaland government will also you know. Okay, encourage okay. people and then mm -hmm. at least give a small like sports quota they can in a daily basis. Mm -hmm. Abhi nitishin lai sab tivi. I mean, naga mandu na bodybuilding di hobi, MMA the international level le jao paron na paro if given. Yeah, the pui na is na international level tivi like. Mami naga mandu. Mami naga mandu. That's that's like a boom, you know. Yeah. So we want to encourage all of you there. If you dream, you know, if you want to be, there is possibility because these are the living example here. And if they can do it, you can also do it. So uh, we have come to, I mean, the end of the series talk. But then, uh, do you have any suggestion for the government if you know how they can help? You know, MMA the holy we bodybuilding holy we. You know, government rakinya agya ina help kro paro. Tan kisi ne mo pula kwan shino tan help kro mon jalvi kro na jani na thayu pray. How do you think the government can help or you know? You can explain better. Uh, just like I said earlier, one sports quota thayu to. You have sports quota in every every field. So when you when you know that that person has potential, take it. Sure. Take them in this in that in that job, na mm -hmm. so that he can also go represent and then he can bring laurel to our state. That's right. Sure. Uh, Manipur la idea, uh, Bobby Singh. Mm -hmm. He is a world renowned bodybuilder. Mm -hmm. Asia world day seven eight times gold medal Wow. And he he was under railway department, mm -hmm. but he got retired. So mm -hmm. 
everybody knows Bobby Singh. When when we talk about bodybuilding, everybody he is a living legend. So, Taekwon Tan Pi, Iman Tak Kuri Nasi Kule, we can also do it, right? True, true. You, we true, just true. see when you give a job under sports quota mm-hmm. to the youngsters who are under me, mm-hmm. they will also feel, you know, they will they will be motivated. Or maybe bhal kushle, maybe government quota or job chuti ta to pay jo. It might be a small chaprasi, it be anything. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know, a source of income. You know, a proper source of income. Ekta every month, ekta actually, we can use that money for our competition. Mm-hmm. So that would encourage the youngsters to. You, you like like you said earlier, music will be, uh, sports will be. People, our parents, they don't encourage mm-hmm. us. Yeah. Even even when I was, when I was initially starting, they they had they were like hesitant. Okay, mm-hmm. but then later on they were like, okay, if you want to do it, then you do it. It's not just a lot of parents they don't encourage. You know, kids to take up music or mm-hmm. sports because there's no scope. Aro, even if you're doing good, also you don't get any job. Mm-hmm. That Chakravarti or Olympic mm-hmm. uh, Olympic, uh, Olympic uh, Aro go Commonwealth. Mm-hmm. She, when she was getting, when she was, you know, she was doing her archery cutting. Mm-hmm. She was not here in Nagaland. She was in Orissa, I guess. Mm-hmm. She was practicing, and then she went, and then she uh, she won medal. Mm-hmm. After that, only she she was. Nagaland State Government mm-hmm. taki DSP la post this, you know. So mm-hmm. there are many stories. Mm-hmm. So it's it's just that the government has to take the initiative and see the potential. Wow. Anything you want? So quick okay. questions. <laughs> so okay, before we end up, is there any tournament you are uh, preparing for at the moment, or what is your next goal or target at the moment? Next goal is to take care of my wife. <laughs> <laughs> Since I recently got married, uh, I'll be taking break for a year. Achha. Um, Spend some quality time with my family, my friends, and all. Wow. Because last year was um, was really, I mean, it was a, it was like a, you know, a struggle for me. Mm-hmm. You know, competing plus the lockdown and everything, mm-hmm. and then I was so much of stress. It was so much of stress with me, like mm-hmm. physically, mentally. I was getting ready for a, for the competition as well as uh, right after the competition, I had to get ready for my wedding and all. Yeah. So I. Maybe for a year, I'll take a break and okay. then just take care of my family. Awesome. What about you? Uh, actually, uh, next month, December, like five, six, seven, eight, like Germany, the World Championship. Wow. Was preparing for the Gem- uh, World Championship, but uh, because like European countries all shut down now. Yes, uh, yes, yes. Due to COVID, so COVID. it has been postponed to next year, next Feb. Year. So Feb, no? Yeah. Wow! All the best, best wishes, and yeah, we pray that you'll bring more laurels and all for the okay. state, for the country, and you also. All the best. Uh, hope you can keep your wife happy and <laughs> <laughs> jokes apart. Yeah, we wish you the best, and Thank then you so much. Uh, yeah, and then we'll end up this section. We'll come back with another segment. Thank you so much. Stay tuned. We're coming back with more fun segments. Experience extraordinary moments at the Fitness House with a vision to improve wellness and fitness. We are equipped with coffee shop, gym center, badminton court, and swimming pool. We provide TFH spot to rejuvenate your body and mind. We are delighted to provide lodging services in TFH Inn. Service for quick bites with a fully equipped kitchen with basic amenities. It offers a home experience retreat. Looking forward to being at your service. segment of the Alabunaga show today we are here at the fitness house and with me is the trainer Sunil and we're gonna do competition between these two you know bodybuilder and MMA let's see who wins today we have a gift voucher Kunji Diwo gift voucher Pabo Yatebra for from the uh, fitness house spa Sunil can you please explain the rules okay go ahead uh, there's very basic and simple rule uh, there should be a measurement of your elbow between both of you okay 
and the uh, rule number two is you should uh, you should not lift your elbow and you should uh, push him opposite side okay opposite side okay chalo let's start cool yeah fine long shot tiger versus moy the chalo chalo let's do let's it see. ready 3 2 and go <laughs> easy 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 come on come on yeah there you go <laughs> there yeah. we go <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> we will come back with another game. Hi, we are calling all the bands from across Nagaland or North East. You know, come for this competition. Wherever you are, we are organizing this battle of bands. So, the audition is happening on the fifth of December at Music Art School in Dimapur, and the selected bands. will go and compete at the finale at music art festival on the 8th of december so hurry up practice and we'll see you all the best hi guys so we're going to do another game so this is with a twist okay you first explain what we're doing and after that i'll put my twist okay we're going to start with the elbow plank then back to the high then again we'll clap with both the hand okay okay Acha. so The twist is you have to sing a song together. Okay, we're gonna sing. By Metani le juta kre ko hima ta thake kan. When you do that, okay. The first person who give up lose. Okay. Chalo, ready? Okay, ready let's go. do it. Chalo. Chalo. One, two, three, go. Ko hima ta thake kan. Ni salagye puta ni. Sing it. Mo kabara aya kan. Chalo, chalo. Aye se. celebration or across india so what's happening you know all the fans you can come and meet you know you you can meet kans vlog aguka aseno yatra kid you know mr smile you name it everyone is coming for this festival so come and meet them greet them take pictures with them take their autograph and get to know them face to face so we hope to see you on the 7th of december at the first nagal youtubers meet at music art festival Hi guys, so we are going to do another game today. We're playing so many games. So, uh, for those who don't know, we are at the coffee shop at the fitness house. They have a coffee shop, they have spa, they have gym, they have inn also. You know, for those who want to come and stay. So today we're gonna do an eating competition. It's very healthy food, no doubt. The salad. So uh, the winner gets a gift voucher. You know, spa. You know. You get, you have to come and experience the spa here. Whoever won win this. So, ladies and gentlemen, all the best. And your time starts now. Chalo, kun jaldi khatam karo ye the pop. Na sir, ni mo khanda thi ka zola. Mo na wa samko. So we have green shower green. Yeah, if you can. Yeah. So we give it for you. So this is for you and your wife if you win. the job eating watching somebody eat book lagi na sai na to moe na de murgi kiman ta khai de nagalen de murgi supply khatam ho ada ida body builder ka i'm so fan of uh, chicken you know chicken na saulum uh, na This is really good. So if you guys want to try the salad, you have to come to the coffee shop here at the fitness house at uh, Dargopatar, opposite uh, ARTC. Almost there. The competition. Come. Come. 
finish it up. Just hold on. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner for this competition. Well done. Woo! So we have one one gift to our chapel, but of you for winning this. And congratulations, and we'll come back to the next segment. Thank you so much, guys. We're calling all the dancers from across Nagaland, from across Northeast or India to come for this competition, the dance battle. All you need to do is dance, you know, anywhere at home. It can be solo or group performance and take a video. It should not be more than two minutes and it should not be less than one minute. And then send your videos WhatsApp to this number and the selected dancers will be invited to perform on the finale at the 7th of December. Please hurry, the competition or uh, the audition ends December 3rd. Hey all you beatboxers out there, we invite you to come and compete for the music uh, beatboxing competition. All you need to do is just do your music, you know, do the music that you do and then record it and send your entries to this number and the selected beatboxers will be invited to compete on the 8th of December at Music Art Festival. So all the best. Hi guys, welcome back to the last segment of the evening. I hope you guys had fun with the game section. Okay guys, we are, let's go back to the fun segment. So uh, this is the very famous segment called Never Have I Ever, okay? So I just, I want you to be like very rapid, random. I'll be very grateful if you can be candid, okay? So just yes or no, okay? okay. Chalo, let's go. Uh, never have I ever experienced street fighting. And street is jagra question, prefer Yes. 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 <laughs> <laughs> okay. Never have I ever kissed on the first date. Yes. No. Okay. Someone is very not a <laughs> Never have I ever drunk texted my ex. Sorry. Drunk dialed my ex. Nisha in a ex can get call uh, no. Yes. <laughs> okay. It's coming up. Never have I ever used steroid for the body. No. Yes. Okay. Never have I ever had crush on any Naga famous personalities. Crush? No. Yes. Yes. You? No. Achha. Matlab. Never have I ever cheated while in relationship. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Very honest, guys. Never have I ever got drunk the night before the tournament or the game. No. No. No, no. That's the dedication. Never have I ever been on a blind date. No. Yes. Okay, very nice. Last one, never have I uh, have never have I ever had friends with benefit? No. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry to his uh. wife. <laughs> Okay, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay, so just you have to explain, okay, the most embarrassing moment so far in your life. Any embarrassing moment? I don't remember. Uh, I have. Uh, when I was in Patkai, That's um, right. uh, I got so high mm -hmm. that it was summer. Uh -huh. I got so high that my me and my friend, we ended up uh, riding the scooter, uh, like half naked in my <laughs> we reached uh, Jumu first gate. Good luck, Katalina. My dad's good. <laughs> Dang! Okay, thanks for sharing. Okay, Naga celebrity that you admire? Any personality? Any admirer right there? Mm. Jamie Vlogs, you do? Jamie Vlogs. Jamie, yeah. Okay. Uh, Vire. Okay, Vire. I love her voice. Achha. Okay, uh, the best body in Nagaland, according to you, is. I mean, men, not women, uh -huh. no? Mota. Okay. Me. Okay, okay. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, great. Uh, best MMA player from Nagaland? According to you, let's say. MMA player. Oh. Me, of course. Okay, awesome. Okay. Uh, any Naga celebrity you want to go on a date with? No? No, I don't remember. Okay. <laughs> what if your wife agrees? Yeah. Uh, Vire, always. <laughs> Okay, Vire. Uh, three things people don't know about you. Three things. You said. Okay. Three um, things people don't know about you. Yeah. I'm funny. Okay. I fool around a lot. Okay. Uh, I'm a foodie. Okay. I eat a lot. Okay. And I sleep a lot. <laughs> okay. Great. It's just the opposite of what you yeah. were saying earlier, right? What about you? Three things people don't know about you. I'm funny first, mm -hmm. of course. Uh, I, I talk a lot. Kotai bishi kore mui. Tajiru kotai nae. Nae. Camera has never been Okay, okay. And then, like, uh, Kabi Bishikai movie. 
Okay. Okay. So the last question for Malong, since you got married recently, uh, can you describe any moment on the bachelor night, if you want to share? Yeah. Okay. Uh, just before I got married, it was okay. like a few days. It was four days or five days before I got married. Okay. I really got drunk, like totally is drunk. Uh, okay, it okay. was my friend's birthday, Hinoto, okay. if he's watching. Um, he let me. Uh, I usually don't drink. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, it's just once in a blue moon. So that blue moon was that day. To time we get gin shot kill So I had around four or five, and I, like wow. I, it was I couldn't drive. Mm -hmm. And next day I had to go to church. So that was hell of a hell of a day. <laughs> okay, thanks for sharing. Yeah. Uh, before we end, we have a gift hamper from the fitness home. Uh, so this is uh, from Fitness House for you. Thank you so oh. much. And here's another one from, yeah. It's, yes, thank you so much. I also have a small gift for you. There's a small membership card Ooh. for Alubonaga. Yay. It's a lifetime membership card. Wow, uh, thank you so much. So my kids can also come with this. Yes. <laughs> thank you. Now I'm going to have a good body like you, man. Please help thank me you. to be good looking, good body like you. Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen. So for those who don't know, this is Bodycraft. Uh, where is it located? It's, can you tell the audio? Yeah. It's uh, opposite Indian restaurant. Okay, Indian restaurant. Yeah, so I, Metro Hospital. Yeah. yeah. I also have a small announcement to make. Uh, since uh, Alubo has been, uh, you know, helping a lot of uh, youngsters as well as uh, Naga people, uh, I thought me and my partner we thought like why not help, you know, give back something to the society as well. So anyone who comes through Alubo will get a fifty percent discount uh, wow. till this year. Wow. Till December. Okay, so they have to DM us and then yeah. we will yeah, if okay. refer you, it to you. You refer it to me, okay. the names okay. and the contact number, then I'll definitely. Wow, yeah. thank you so much for that. Yeah, Thanks. please uh, make sure that you avail this opportunity. Yeah, with this, we've come to the end and I hope you guys had a good time. So before that, uh, if you want to have, say, a pledge to uh, the audience or to our subscriber, please, yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll uh, just like to share a few words, like uh, whatever you do in life, like uh, do it with all your heart, like put in your time and dedication that people will start respecting you for what you're doing. That's it, like, and then apni la call achieve kro na, apni ki target ase. Apni monso pan nukri le, apni do keep apna asi do punjibo. So apni la sacrifice people like So dedication, hard work, or sacrifice kri na kuri ki kam deoli bi. First of all, I would like to thank each and every one of you, to you, to the team, as well as to the people of Nagalin. Uh, I am where I am. It's all because of your your love and your you know support. I could I I don't think I would have reached to Uzbekistan if if it was on my own. So all thanks to my uh, my friends, my family, and to the people of Nagalin. Uh, please do uh, remember us in your in your prayers. Mm -hmm. Keep supporting mm -hmm. us and. Hopefully, and then, and we will also make our make sure that we will bring uh, you know more medals for our state and for our country. Thank you so much, both of you. And then, as I said earlier, we wish you the best. And then, uh, we'll be praying for you. So please bring more laurels for the state, so for much. our country, for our people. Yeah, thank you so much. And with this, we've come to the end, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, here's a pledge from my side also. Please keep supporting them. And uh, on behalf of the team, we want to say thank you for always supporting them and also helping them and all. So don't stop this. And we can do this together. You know, we don't need to depend on others. If we can come together, we can make it. So with this, we've come to the end. We'll see you next week. Thank you and goodbye. <laughs>